Hi, I'm Marion Landry, Technical Marketing Manager with Autodesk. In this Small Tips and Tricks, I want to show you how you can use triggers with the combination of visibility alternative to switch the TV on or off. For this particular example, I will turn the TV on and off by using triggers in combination with visibility alternative. Now, this is a very simple example, and I hope that this will open a door for you to think about different ways you can use showcase and be really creative. So first of all, let me create a showcase generic material, which I will uh, change the properties and add a image instead of a color for the material. I'm going to browse from my image and load it on my properties. Now I'm going to change the mapping type to be triplanar so I can apply the uh, image properly on this uh, object. So first, I need to apply this material onto this object. And you see that the scaling of my image is wrong and the UV map is not appropriate. So I'm going to first press on the auto fit button. Then I'm going to move the texture manually. So here I have the gizmo, which is highlighted in this white cube. And I can scale the gizmo to the appropriate size uh, that I want my image to be applied on my object. So this seems to be right. So now I can get out of this uh, UV mapping um, coordinate mode. So I'm going to stop moving the texture. And now I have an image applied properly on my polygon. So this is the first polygon and therefore the first state of my TV, which is the TV open. I'm going to rename this material for TV on so I can clearly identify it. I'm going to rename this um, other material that I have, which is just a black material to be TV off. Next, I'm going to press A to open the alternative lineup. I'm going to create a visibility lineup. So my first visibility mode, I'm going to select the TV on object and add it to my, to my visibility lineup and call this one TV on. Next, I'm going to duplicate this object by going to the edit menu duplicate. So now I have two object and I'm going to apply the TV off material on this second object and load it in my second alternative and rename this alternative TV off. So now I have two alternative with two different objects. The first is TV on and the second is TV off. Pressing B will open the behavior menu where I will be able to create a trigger. So I'm going to go ahead and create a 3D trigger and rename this one right away so I don't get confused TV on. So to have my TV on, I'm going to press on the TV off object. So this will be the trigger object and I'm going to associate this trigger to the TV on uh, visibility alternative. Then I'm going to switch to my TV on visibility and create the second trigger, which I'll rename TV off. Now the object TV on will become the selection. So the trigger object and it will be linked to the TV off alternative. So let's try this under presentation mode because you know that uh, triggers only work under presentation mode. So I'm turning to presentation mode and when I roll over to the object, I can click on it and it switch my mode. So basically the TV, when it's on, if I click on it, it will switch to the visibility off and vice versa. So this is a very simple example of how you can use the trigger in combination with the visibility lineup. And I really hope that you take this to the next level and get really creative with your showcase presentation.